Spiritual preparation is another aspect. Spiritually prepare for the month of Ramadan. How do we spiritually prepare for the month of Ramadan? Firstly, if you have fasts that you missed, make up for it. You have approximately 30 days. 30 days. That's more than enough. Make up for your missed fasts and start from now as soon as possible. It's the month of Sha'ban. Fast as much as you can if you don't have missed fasts. Because the Prophet ﷺ would prepare for the month of Ramadan by fasting almost the entirety of the month of Sha'ban. Why did he do that? So then when he gets into the month of Ramadan, he's already accustomed to it. He's already in that pre-Ramadan gear. And all what remains when Ramadan comes is the sweetness of fasting. We find ourselves now Ramadan is starting, we try to get accustomed to it. Ten days have passed. Now you're getting into the zone. It's too late. You have to start Ramadan with the fastest gear. So that is one way how to spiritually prepare for yourself. Secondly, make a lot of istighfar. Any great major event should be, should be precluded with istighfar spiritually. So this is a, 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 like a precursor to the month of Ramadan. Do istighfar, repent from your sins so that you're spiritually purified and refined when the month of Ramadan begins. And ibadah will be so easy, so much easy. Because remember, sins are a burden. It's a baggage on us. It weighs it, us down. It will take away from our strength to be able to do ibadah. So this is how we got to spiritually prepare for ourselves. Prepare ourselves for the month of Ramadan. Ramadan, Ramadan.